Hey, it's Quinn with PTSD While Black, and now I'm back doing some more uh, random tarot readings because I can. Oh, I'm going to ask my ancestors what they would like to talk about and what can I pull on? What kind of story can we get? Um, feel free to follow, like, subscribe, or not. I really don't care. This is my journal. This is just me <laughs> experimenting with my ability to, to do tarot readings. Um, I used to read by the book only. So, yeah. So, thanks for watching my channel. Um, thanks for participating and helping to stop gang stalking as well. And if you are gang stalking, hey, maybe we'll find some information out about you. So, what do the people watching this channel need to know right now? What is it that needs to be shared with the people watching this channel? Divine spirit guides, guardians, angels, ancestors, and ascended beings, and all that is, and all that ever was and will be. What is it that the people watching this channel need to know? <clears throat> What is it that these folks need to know? What is it that you would have them know? All right, let's see. Okay. All right. Ooh, it, that flew out. Ooh, betrayal. Betrayal is the thing they want you to know about. Let's look at this particular card um anansi um is the character and it's actually done as a feminine character <clears throat> who really betrayed you betrayals from others mirrors your betraying yourself betrayal is a web that disrupts everything you thought you knew use discernment in your relationships betrayal makes it difficult to trust but without trust, your relationships are a lie. Trust that no matter what happens and no matter how long it takes, you will survive and thrive. So I think this is both for the people surviving gang stalking as well as those who are creating the issues with gang stalking. Who betrayed you? The real question is how have you betrayed or abandoned yourself? I am willing to know the truth is what this card is saying. I am willing to know the truth. I'm willing to know the truth. Why don't you come tell me? Hey, ancestor, spirit guide, guardians, why don't you tell me what is the truth? What is the truth that that my people here who are survivors of gang stalking or who are active gang stalkers or people who are curious about gang stalking, people who live with PTSD, what is the truth that we need to know about how someone has abandoned themselves? These are random <clears throat> cards that I wrote out while just listening to stuff. Um, yeah, so what is it that you want to talk about, ancestors, spirit guides, guardians, angels, ascended beings, all that is and all that ever was? What is it that you want to talk about as far as this betrayal of how the collective has betrayed themselves? Those who are watching have betrayed themselves. It's a Taurus. Has betrayed themselves. Okay. I'm just going to pull from the middle here. In June. Possibly this happened in June. Someone betrayed themselves. <laughs> Jeez, isn't that when, like, most of the hacking started? Okay. What else? There's a Pisces involved in this betrayal. But justice is yours. <laughs> okay, Kent. So, a Taurus, possibly a Taurus betrayed a, a Pisces in June, or the other way around. Someone who didn't honor their own truth went out and got involved with somebody else. Okay. Let's see. <clears throat> and what's the last thing? I'll pull one more. What else do the ancestors want to talk about with this? You're good in bed. <laughs> you shut up! <laughs> Someone who is good in bed betrayed somebody in June. Ooh, 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 ooh. Get it? Okay. Let's, let's get into this. Let's get some letters on it just for fun. I'm doing all the things that I shouldn't be doing right now. I'm doing the letters and everything else first. 
Dale's dropped out. That's too many. So can I get some letters um, on this? Maybe the initials of the person who did the betraying. Can I get initial of the person who did the betraying that was good in bed? Who was that? Who was that? You want to talk about that? Ooh. <laughs> they gave me the D. <laughs> Someone with a D was good in bed. Okay. Let's see. So David Daniel. DeMonte. Denise. Derek, Derek, Derek feels, Derek feels really strong. Who else? B, DB. So Derek, someone whose name started with a D, betrayed somebody whose name started with a B or vice versa, you know, Flip it, fix it to whatever you need it to be. Betty. Barbara. Brenda. Who's this B? Who's that B? Who that B? E. D B E. Let's check that out and see what that is. <clears throat> I like, I like the way Philosophical does things because she's so cool. Um, but she uses Urban Dictionary. <laughs> Dumb bitch energy! Yes, bitch! <laughs> <laughs> Dumb bitch energy. Dumb bitch energy. Okay, some dumb bitch energy. That's all it's giving me. That's hilarious. Oh, God. Somebody betrayed somebody with some dumb bitch energy. Who's out here doing this? Who's out here being messy? Okay, can can I get a... Uh, oh, again, the Wheel of Fortune wants to be out in reverse. All right, maybe you needed to sit something out. Maybe somebody needs to take a break. What else we got here? The Five of Cups, somebody walked away. Five of Cups usually means... <clears throat> That you got this loss of these three cups behind you, but you got these two cups in front of you. Maybe you should focus on what's there. Take your losses and move on with your dumb bitch energy. Just just move on. Okay? Whoever's good in bed, <laughs> just move on. <laughs> what else y'all want to talk about? Oops, sorry. Sorry about that. What else you want to talk about? Spirit guides, guardians. Angels and ancestors, what else, what else do we need to know? What does the collective need to know about this dumb bitch energy that created some sort of betrayal in June? What else do you need to know? What else do we need to, to share about? What else do you want to talk about? Is there anything else that you want to talk about within this? Who did they walk away from? Who did they walk away from? With a betrayal. Who did they walk away from? Okay. Three of hearts, but it was in three of hearts. Three of swords in reverse. They walked away from some sort of heartbreak. But I always have to look them up because y'all, you know, I don't remember these cards. Three of Swords is usually is usually the card of, um, yeah, it's heartbreak. In health, it can mean like a surgery that's needed or cutting something out. Um, This card pretends forgiveness, healing, and even a little optimism. Your heart is very resilient. The pain isn't absent. It, it hasn't been avoided, but feelings 
have been shared and the reconciliation is on the horizon. They walked away from reconciling. They walked away from sharing, sharing the pain and healing and being resilient and working together. Instead of working together with somebody, they walked away. They walked away. Okay. With some dumb bitch energy. <laughs> That's all I got for right now. I'm stupid. All right. I'm going to drink some water and do another reading. Okay. Bye.